Hi and welcome to Ottawa English. In this video I'm going to give you a basic comparison of the CELPIP and PTE core English writing tests to help you decide uh, which one is easiest for you. Both of the tests assess your coherence and cohesion, your lexical resource and vocabulary, your readability and your task fulfillment. CELPIP uses an email and survey response to make this assessment, whereas PTE Core uses a summary, uh, an email, and then any writing you do in the listening and reading sections of the test. In other words, things like the summary that you write in the listening section contributes to your writing assessment as do the gap fill exercises in the listening and reading sections. The CELPIP writing test at 60 minutes is much longer than the PTE core writing test at 20 minutes. In CELPIP you have 26 minutes to complete the email and 27 minutes to complete the survey response. In PTE core you have 9 minutes to complete a summary and 10 minutes to write your email. That's not a lot of time, and that may make PTE core writing harder for some people. That said, you don't have to write quite as much for PTE core as you do for CELPIP. If you use your full allowance for CELPIP, you could end up writing 440 words. But even with your full allowance for PTE core, you'll write less than 200 words. If you write more than that allowance, both of the tests will penalise you. But PTE Core's penalty is much more severe. In PTE Core, if you write even one word more than your allowance, you won't get any points at all for that response. So the artificial intelligence checks the length of your writing before it starts to check anything else. And if you're over the word limit, you just don't get a score. CELPIP, on the other hand, will deduct a couple of points for exceeding the word limit, but you will still get a score. As with all of the PTE questions, there are repetitions. In other words, you may have to write two emails or two summaries, maybe even three. I think two is fairly normal. Uh, so my feeling is that PTE core is harder for anyone who struggles with spelling. There just seem to be so many places where you have to write the answers with no way of checking your spelling accuracy. In CELPIP you have the standard spell check on your screen, so provided you leave enough time to go back and check what you've written, you're equipped with a tool that can help. Because PTE core is checked by artificial intelligence, there's a lot more emphasis on keywords than there is in CELPIP, which is marked by a person. So overall, my feeling is that getting a high score in CELPIP writing requires carefully developing your ideas with details, whereas PTE core requires a lot more attention to the keywords and the spelling. If you're looking for a little bit of help with your preparation, keep in mind that working with a tutor turns your passive learning into active learning. It targets the things that matter and it saves you a lot of time trolling through YouTube, picking up information that may be a little bit misleading. So if you need help with your PTE core preparation or your CELPIP preparation, do give me a call or text me at 613-614-6460. If you've enjoyed this video, if it's been helpful to you, please click on the like button below. Uh, if you're getting ready for your test, best of luck. And thanks for watching. Bye-bye.